welcome back to my channel. Hopefully the lighting isn't too bad in this video because in my past few videos I've been getting really negative comments about my lighting and I know that it can seem red because I have a red wall right here or the weather is bad outside and I don't have any natural lighting. Um, so I do apologize about that. I am trying to save up money to buy new lighting, but you know, I got to work with what I got. So um, today I'm going to be doing my May favorites. And honestly, I wasn't even thinking about doing my May favorites because I've been so busy lately with just working in school. I have school five days a week. Also, I have to work right after school. And uh, next week, I just want to give you guys a heads up. So next week, um, People are leaving on vacation and I have to work every single day so I'm really sorry that I haven't been posting that many videos on this channel but I know that I've been trying to post at least two or three a week and now it seems like it's down to one so I'm just apologizing for next week if you guys don't see a video right away but I'm trying to pre-record a lot of videos for you guys so after this video I might do a tag video I'm not sure yet but I have been getting tagged to do the rainbow something rainbow tag so I think I might do that anyway enough rambling uh, just want to let you guys know that I'm super busy and you know who is it but um, I am going to pre-record and all that so today I'm going to be doing May favorites and um, like I said I wasn't really planning on doing this but you guys messaged me and was just like oh I can't wait for your May favorites I'm like crap all right I need to do it so I got a few products together let's just jump into it I have a few beauty products and clothes and just an accessory. I am not sponsored by NYX Cosmetics. All the NYX Cosmetic products that I'm about to show you, um, I purchased myself at all. First NYX products are their NYX blushes. It's their powder blushes and my very first one was Pinched and I think this one was really popular. It's like a coral peachy color and it has gold reflex in it. I've been really enjoying this when I want to look like I have some sun on my face, just giving myself a little um, natural glow and when I want to pair it with some like peach lip gloss or something, yeah. Pinched is the way to go, especially for you blondes. This looks really good on blondes, too. Uh, the next one is Mocha, and I really, really like this. This is a matte blush, and it's like a mid-tone pink color, so I like this if I want to do like a nude lip or a pink mouth or something like that. But yeah, this one, Pinched, has shimmer in it, and Mocha does not. But I do want to try a few of these blushes. And NYX always has those buy one, get one 50% off. Next are lip products, and these are the NYX Butter Glosses. And these have become really popular here on YouTube, and I was like, these cannot be that great. So I went to Ulta, and I picked one up, and my first one was Eclair. My first impression was that I didn't really like it. The only thing I liked was that it tastes good and that it smells really good. But Eclair is really close to my natural lip color, so I didn't think it did anything for me. So I decided to go back and buy two more in a little more brighter colors. This one, I can't even pronounce... It might even be meringue and I don't know but it's the 04 one this is like the seriously the perfect pink um, it has a purple undertone in it which I go for in a lot of my lip glosses and lipsticks so yeah I will post the name right here but that's what that one's called and this one has become my everyday wear and I absolutely love it the next one when I want to go for like a peach or orangish looking uh, toned mouth this one is an apple strudel and I love this one I actually wore this one yesterday so I've been wearing these like every day you know just wearing it at school if I don't want to wear lipstick next step. is a concealer and for those of you who know in my past few videos I've showed clips of me breaking out I'm suffering from acne right now and it's slowly turned into cystic acne which, if any of you guys know, are so painful, and I've just been getting them on the side of my face, constantly touching my face, and yeah, I've been suffering from acne, so I've been trying to find a really good full coverage concealer, and the one I came across was something that I've used last year and previous years before, but it was in the wrong shade, so I went back and got a NYX concealer in a jar, and this is full coverage concealer, so any of you guys are looking for a new full coverage concealer to hide your under eyes, or even to conceal your blemishes like I do, this one is perfect. It's seriously so full coverage, you just need to pat it onto your skin, and when you pat, it leaves even more full coverage, because when you start to like smear it, you're not really getting any like buildable coverage at all. So this one is in light pale, because I wanted it to be underneath my eyes, to do my dark circles, and to conceal my blemishes. I'm currently wearing right now. It completely conceals the redness, and I know that they have these in all different variety of colors, and I will be purchasing more of these, because this is like a holy grail. And it's really thick and creamy. It's amazing. And it's not scented. 
No. Their NYX HD Studio, and it's their loose powder. This one is in translucent. I just apply it with a fluffy brush all over my face just to conceal my concealer um, to make sure that it doesn't smudge or move out throughout the day. But I just got mine translucent, and I swear to you that this could be a dupe for the Makeup Forever. Let me get it. Makeup Forever HD. I swear because it gives me just a flawless finish and it makes your skin feel super soft and I know that they also have this in light to medium and then also medium to dark colors and I will definitely be going back to just to get like a color tone one for summer for when I get dark I can seriously say it's miracle in a jar and just use it with a fluffy brush or a Ooh, I'm looking ghostly white now don't hate don't hate beauty bag and this one is by Vera Bradley I love all the colors in here. It's a seafoam green, a baby pink, a yellow, and orange. I love all of these colors. And this is a uh, cosmetic bag, and I actually just put all my brushes in here. And then I actually have a separate one for my makeup. But I've just been putting my brushes in here, and it's so cute. It can fit in your purse. It has a little mirror right here and another pocket. Um, it looks like it won't hold a lot, but it really does. And I got this from a friend and yeah she got it at Hallmark and I just been really enjoying this and it's been really helpful. You guys are gonna go purchase this and you're gonna be like oh my gosh Emily you're so right. This is a body do and <laughs> it's an after bath oil body mist and it has pheromones in it and if you guys know anything about your pheromones it's just kind of like your natural scent of what you give off um, and it's all about your your scent not anyone else's it's what your scent creates. Sorry guys my camera just fell off my dresser okay I was talking about pheromones so pheromones are um, just your natural scent of what your body makes um, mine smells really good some people smells like baby powder some people were all different some people smell like fruit so this one's body do and what I do is right when I get out of the shower I spray this on my legs and my arms and my chest an oil that makes you look super shiny just glowing and this is in the scent pink cupcake and it smells like vanilla and just like cake and the best thing about this product of what I've loved and I've heard people tell me this that my skin is seriously so soft and I've since I've been using this every day my skin's constantly getting just softer and softer like my Nana she grabbed my arm the other day and she's like oh your skin is so soft and I'm serious you guys so you just spray this on your body right after you take a bath or when you get out of the shower you can also put this in your bathtub to leave your water smelling really good and the scent is not too powerful but it's not too light either this smells like straight up Pink cupcake, vanilla, yumminess, and different flavors like green tea, pomegranate, all that good Next stuff. Next thing I'm going to talk about, it's called Coochie Cream. And Coochie Cream is a unisex conditioning cream. So it's a shaving cream that you can use on your legs, your underarms, um, anywhere that you want to shave. <laughs> But this one is in Pink Cupcake also because I got it to match my body do. And this one, if you guys suffer through razor bump, even through razor burn, this will prevent that. It leaves your skin so smooth and so soft. And you can also use this as a conditioner for your hair, which I've done plenty of times. And like I said before, they have this in so many different flavors like green tea, pomegranate. What I didn't say was that this is from Pure Romance. And I'll leave a consultant down below. I purchased these myself, but if you guys want to purchase these, Go down below and I'll leave a consultant which you guys can talk to and order off of if you're interested. But this stuff I use absolutely every day and I love it, love it, love it. It leaves my skin so soft and smells so good. I think I'm actually going to try the green tea one after this. Now I have a nail polish and I actually have this on my toes and I did have it on my fingers at one point. I'll show a picture right here. This is the Julie G's nail polish in bikini. This is a really neon peachy pink color. It's gorgeous. Um, I've gotten so many compliments on it and people just wanted to know it was on my nails so in my previous Megan Fox video and another video I had this on my fingers and like I said it's Julie G and it's in bikini and I've been loving this it's a great summer color next I have a hair accessory and this is just a little flower it's a peachy flower um, my friend got me this from forever 21 and I want to go back and get so many more it's great for um, you know, just making you look a little bit girly. You can just like pull your hair back like that. 
And it just looks like so cute, right? I have a picture of me wearing it on my Instagram if you want to go check it out. But I've been loving putting like different flowers in my hair and just like clips. Just giving it a little more girliness and just reminds me of springtime and summertime. This wallet, which is actually a wristlet. And this has been a lifesaver for me, especially if you don't feel like carrying your purse. Um, I just have my ID in here, which I flipped so you guys couldn't see it. So you can put your cards in it. It also opens up. And, oh, I got some money just floating around. But it does have compartments for you to put your cards and a little compartment for you to put your change in just more pockets inside. You can put your phone back here. It fits with iPhones and all other phones. But, yeah, it's so cute and even has this little wristlet. And I even hooked up my hand sanitizer to it. Um, my pattern is in Party Punch, and this is from 31. Um, if you guys are interested in purchasing this, it's just really cute. It comes in handy, um, especially if you know you're going to festivals or the movies or, you know, baseball games or sports events and you don't feel like carrying your purse. This is really, really good. And it's cute. It's like all compact. And I'll leave a consultant down below if you guys want to purchase it. Okay, and the very last thing are some clothes from Victoria's Secret. And I mentioned them in a haul video. These are the Victoria's Secret cropped leggings. And I have been loving these. I wear them every day to school. Um, they hug your leg perfectly. They're comfortable. They're stretchy. Um, they're fashionable. I mean, you can get the band in any color that you want. But I have multiple pairs of these. And I've just been wearing them a lot this month. So I just thought I would mention that. But that is all of my May favorites. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Thumbs up if you liked my favorites videos. And in the next video, I will be doing a tag video. Oh, wait a minute, we're not done. I didn't even tell you guys my favorite song of the month, which I normally do. And I don't have a favorite movie this month because I've been so busy that I haven't even gone to the movies. Um, so I don't have a favorite movie, but I do have two favorite songs okay it's called that power with justin bieber um i do like justin bieber songs and this one is awesome if you crank it up in your car your bass will go boom 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 so that song and the other song is called the way featuring mac miller and um i actually don't have who sings i think it's like adriana i don't even know officially my May favorites. Thumbs up if you guys like my favorites videos and don't forget to follow me on Twitter, like my Facebook page. I made a Vine so go follow me on there. It's hooked up to my Twitter and I also Keek so follow me on Keek. All my links will be down below and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!